scratch your cute little nose. <laughs> It's squeaky clean. I would just like to dry it. Just gonna turn this on now so we can begin cooking. It should be ready in five minutes. Let me grab the meat. So I have three hamburgers here. This is what I'm gonna make it for now. And then let's see what we have later in the afternoon well it's almost afternoon now it's 12 so I want to make something more and then probably we're gonna go to the beach later so hope you guys are having an amazing um, Independence Day if you are outside of the USA hello to all of you and of course hello to all my friends around the whole wide world hello to all of you so let me just remove this one and then put them on my Kamdu electric grill first let me just put uh, salt and pepper on them it's just three guys there's just three of us here today so I'll be right back wash my hands quick Pepper, got my salt. Oh, by myself, don't wanna be. Oh, by myself, come on, you can open it now. Some black pepper and give it a little bit of touch, a touch of love. You hear something guys that's my AC it's so loud
Let me turn this off. This is very nice. It only took me 10 minutes. Oh wait, let me grab the paper towel. Happy Independence Lemon! I have a cheese here. Packaging is super cool. It's a American flag. Okay, a uh, lettuce. I also got it from the local supermarket here. Our tomato. So let me prepare all this and, and I'll show you guys the final product. He just put the tomato back in the fridge. Na 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 na. Let me just wash this quick. My um, tomatoes here. Do you love tomato? I love tomato. Some people doesn't like it, but like I said, that's understandable. Just because I like tomato doesn't mean that all the people in the world loves tomato just as much as I do. So you don't have to add tomatoes on our cheeseburger if you don't like tomatoes. Now one, two, three, four, I think that is enough. Okay, let me just put our tomato in this bowl. Look at that fresh tomato so I got some mayo here and I would like to add just a little bit of ketchup and then mix it well it's because I ran out of a thousand island dressing to garnish this so I'm just using my mayo and ketchup to substitute the thousand island dressing so it looks like it's all mixed up and then we can start assembling all our American cheese burger Oops, our hamburger we'll add the cheese I love Pickles, so I'm gonna add some more pickles, onions. Mm. Look at that. This one is gonna be a double cheese burger. We'll add some cheese. Mm -hmm. And then we'll cover it. What do you think, guys? Te poesías, cuentos, mi amor. Yeah. El amor es tan corto, olvidarte. No, no, yeah. Los dos amamos de más. Enamorado de tu mirar y tú de otra. ¿Por qué eres así? Here's our final product. Let's eat. I have French fries here. Cheers! Mmm! Mmm! Cheers! is boiling 
and I would like to cut some fruits so I hope you guys are having a wonderful Sunday actually today is Sunday July 4th it's the 4th of July here in the United States so I love watermelons I almost have watermelon in my house once a week so I will cut this one for you and I hope you are having a wonderful Sunday it's Sunday afternoon here in Texas the 4th of July um, I don't know when I will be able to upload this video definitely not on the same day because sometimes it takes me a whole day to edit my video especially if it's a longer one so let's start cutting this hope everyone is doing amazing I'm using my tiny little knife I think I'll just grab the bigger knife this one I'm afraid that it's gonna break by the way I've read a comment there somewhere in my previous videos not to get a ceramic knife because you can't um, sharpen the ceramic knife so thinking about it because I like to have uh, different knives so <laughs> I am just going to grab the grand knife that I got it's not very straight look at that mmm super duper red watermelons looking fresh okay. all right let me grab some plate to put my watermelon here's our watermelon guys anyone want some please help yourself don't be shy it is super sweet super yummy mm. watermelon yummy yummer now on to my next fruit that i want to cut today i want to cut another melon it's a honeydew it's white so the fruits that i'm gonna be uh, having today is white blue and red so just like my bracelet guys it's red white and blue since it is a fourth of july i have lots of scratch from nermo because um when he's resting i always try to like bug him kiss him and then he would scratch me so yeah if you see a lot of like scratch from my legs that's from nermo my cat so let me cut this beautiful honeydew here that i also pick up from the local supermarket here and we're just gonna cut it there just be very careful with the knife it's a sharp knife meat clever knife from grand knife there we go look at that mm -hmm. a beautiful honeydew and I'm just going to cut it into another half. Okay. Let me just clean the inside. Need to take out all that seeds here. He is definitely still sleeping. Wake up, Nermon! What happened to your nose? Who scratched you? That's what you get for always going out. Let's put my legs on him. <laughs> Nermon is up here <laughs> from <laughs> bed <laughs> with Riley. And he's just looking so comfortably uh, laying here. And I'm here. over here just going like that. <laughs> Such a cutest boy. Mm. <laughs> Show them. Wait. Oh. All right. So let me just wash my hands one more time, just to make sure that our food is very clean.
the corn should be ready in like five minutes so i can proceed to the next recipe i will be making today for this video so i have white onions here guys let me just cut it i probably need only half of this i'm not gonna put a lot of onions because the meat i'm using is only one pound so i'm gonna cut it this way so that if ever the kids don't want to eat the onions they can just pick and throw the onion how's your sunday going guys i'm just here in my kitchen working with you and i'm gonna grab some garlic let me peel them first let me move the onion so i can work on the garlic here So let's start cooking first. I'm gonna add my olive oil. Maybe that much. Now I will add my onions. I'm just going to make it a little bit um, caramelized and brownish. Add my garlic. I just love the smell of garlic and the onions guys. It smells so amazing right now in the kitchen. I will add now the meat. Have my minced meat here and then just cook the minced meat. Okay guys, so now I think it is time to add some of my spices that are here. Chili powder, Mexican style mi amor. There you go, smells so delish. Next will be my ground cumin. Smells so good. Next will be our dried oregano. little bit of salt a little bit of black pepper it smells so yummers yum yum and a little bit of this sauce And then I'm gonna add a little bit of diced tomato. Next will be my tomato sauce. There we go. And just a little bit of sugar. It looks like it is now ready. Let me just boil some of the hot dogs that I'm gonna need to go with our chili here. So, looks like our water is boiling and now uh, we're gonna add some of our deliciously hot dogs here. And then we're just gonna drop our hot dogs here super hot super duper hot it's a boiling water hotter than me have to be very careful we don't want to burn ourselves boil it for five minutes and should be ready deliciously chili dogs for the 4th of july happy 4th to all my american friends out there all right i'm about to assemble all the foods that we have today that i prepared for all of us i hope you guys enjoy your sunday it is a beautiful day at least where i'm at so that's our hot dog buns and let me prepare it for you quick i got my plate here 
Okay. And the hot dog is right here next to me. Let me cut it in the middle so we can fill it. I think I cut the wrong side, guys. Let's see. It doesn't matter now, okay? Alrighty. And this one. I'm gonna change something for you so that it's gonna be a deliciously. Why I am so stupid? It's already pre cut. Here it is. Okay. Here. Now, let me just fill it. Okay, let me put the hot dog inside. That. Okay, guys. Looking pretty, right? Next. Other one. Here. Now, we're gonna top it off with our chili here. Okay. Smells delicious. that let's take a bite here's the final product everyone help me take a bite with this it smells so delicious juicy and yummy looking so cheers cheers mm. Mm. let me just uh, add a little bit of sharp cheddar cheese now if you're allergic to some cheese you don't have to add this it's fine without cheese but i would just like to add a little bit of cheddar cheese on mine since i love cheese so once again here's another bite mm. all right everybody it's time to end the video here. I thank you all so much for your precious time. I hope you like this video. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Share, subscribe if you haven't subscribed to me yet. And I hope to see you guys next time. Stay safe everyone. Bye! <laughs> Nos amamos de más Enamorado de tu mirar Y tú de otra Porque eres así Y así Bebé No sientes lo mismo Lo mismo Lo que yo sentí Pa' ti Yo fui Solo una noche más Lo que es, para ti fue una aventura y yo bebé, quería ser tu...